back on the channel with this awesome blue galaxy a52 5g and on that recent poll you decided one and two to benchmark test score and ranking and today we're gonna find out how performant can be this um, galaxy a52 5g variant because also it's a 4g variant but today only for this one so we're just gonna test out this smartphone in this Antutu benchmark app and we're gonna find out the total score and the ranking for this model as you can see the battery temperature at this moment it's 27.7 and the CPU temperature it's 26.1 and this Galaxy A52 5G it's coming with a Snapdragon 750G a 5G chipset with 6 gigabytes of RAM and 128 of storage also you can put a micro SD up to one terabyte on this model also this Galaxy A52 5G is running Android 11 with One UI 3 on top and Samsung promises at least four years of security updates also for security the A52 5G it's coming with Samsung Knox security framework and let's test out this smartphone now at the end of this video we're gonna find out the total score and ranking for this device before doing this test the battery just increased on 29.3 and the CPU temperature 27.4 just gonna tap on test and um, it's just started you may skip this video also if you want to to see the results for this um, Galaxy A52 5G as you can see the animations are not laggy but not actually very smooth and um, I'd be actually surprised to see a good result for this model because it's coming with this new Snapdragon 750 a 5G chipset enough RAM and enough storage plus Android 11 and One UI 3 Okay, so uh, let's wait till the end and let's find out the final result.
the final score, which is quite good. 330,995 points for this Galaxy A52 5G. It's actually a very good score for this mid-range and I can see the CPU had quite a big score of uh, 114,456 and uh, GPU also 77,585 and uh, let's have a look on memory 67,964 and the last one with 70,990 we got also on Android 11 so during this test wow the battery just dropped with 2% and um, CPU temperature with 1% uh, increase also which is actually not too bad let's have a better look here yeah temperature 30.7 and the CPU wow is looking actually good 32 degrees so it's not hot at all during this um, 10 minutes test let's see okay let's go back now and let's go on ranking and let's see on what place we can put this uh, A52 5G. After waiting a few minutes, a few good minutes for ranking to show up on this app, it still doesn't show up. So we're just going to go home at this moment and we're just going to try to find out looking on the website on what place we can put this Galaxy A52 5G. Having the ranking right here on the website, if you can see, it's February 2021 and going down on this uh, score, 330, we can find out that we can put it on the same place with uh, Xiaomi Mi 10 Lite 5G with quite similar score, 330, 316,000 points which is quite on the same place. Also Galaxy 52 5G it does better than a Redmi K30 5G again with 6 GB of RAM and 128 storage better than Galaxy Note 9 better than Galaxy S9 Plus but uh, the score is a bit lower, slightly lower than uh, Realme 7 5G Galaxy Note 10 Lite and Mi 8 so the score it's quite good for this uh, mid-range quite uh, great actually 330,995 and uh, having this score now we can um, play a few games and we're gonna test out how performant can be on um, gameplay so uh, that would be on a further video so if you got any suggestions just leave a comment on uh, that uh, section and now we're just gonna move on Geekbench uh, 5 and we're gonna find out the results on uh, the CPU and the GPU performance okay and we are on the app now my device Samsung A526B Android 11 Octa Core and uh, we're just gonna go on uh, history on CPU and we got this uh, following score on single core we got uh, 630 points and on multi core we got uh, 1906 and um, this is the result on this uh, CPU you can see the single core performance right here and all the scores and we're just gonna go further on multi-core performance alright and now let's go back and let's go on compute and this is the total score on this uh, Ginkbench app and um, I would like to see also a bit of comparison with other devices and if you can see my device 13, uh, 12, and of course cannot be close on the Galaxy S20 Plus not even S8 not even Mi 90 Pro and uh, let's say it's just between uh, well A71 from last year 
and not that close on Pocophone F1. So this is the result on this uh, compute and let's go on CPU and uh, let's find out if we can uh, find also a comparison. So on single core we got 630 and um, let's see where it's close to Mi 90 Pro, Redmi K20 Pro and Galaxy A71 is not that close so better than A71 and on multi-core we got 1.9 and it's uh, coming close to Pocophone F1 and Poco F1 again and better than Galaxy A71 so it may be interesting to do a comparison video with this uh, Samsung Galaxy A71 going through all the specs, comparison, display, audio and uh, even games so this was the results for this uh, Geekbench 5 and Antutu benchmark uh, up. I hope you make an opinion about this um, great uh, awesome blue Galaxy A52 5G and like I said on the next video we may do a game test and why not a comparison with uh, other devices. Being said thanks for watching and see you soon with another interesting video.